جیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم الحمد للہ وصلاۃ وسلام علی خاتم الانبیاء وی آر اسٹارٹنگ آور تھرڈ ڈسکورس ان دس سیریز آف ڈسکشنز آن اسلامک تھاٹ اینڈ کلچر ٹوڈیز ٹاپک از دا اسپرٹ آف اسلامک تھاٹ اینڈ رول آف توحید اسلامک تھاٹ از فاؤنڈیڈ آن توحیدک قرآنک ورلڈ ویو واٹ از دیٹ مین دیٹ سمپلی مینس دیٹ وی آر ڈکلیئرنگ کانشیسلی اینڈ رسپانسبلی اللہ سبحانہ و تعالیٰ از دا کریٹر آف ہول یونیورس اینڈ مین کائنڈ سیکنڈلی یونیورس اینڈ نیچر is not divine and thirdly human being has a purpose and role in society when we have these three things then we call it world view and when we have these three things based on tawhid we call it tawhidic or quranic world view now what is non tawhidic world view next slide please in non tawhidic world view which is based essentially on a speculative philosophy or some kind of spiritual experience or some kind of uh, social uh, convention first and foremost is nature is taken as holy or divine so you find in various cultures statements our neighboring country has a culture where they call dharti mata and unfortunately in our own country in presence of better concepts and words sometimes i feel very much uh, sad to see that instead of vatan people use uh, the word dharti pak dharti what does that mean therefore uh, first thing is if people have taken nature as holy when you say gau mata which means cow is your mother or you say monkey is your ancestor whatever is said all that presumes that nature has been taken as holy or divine secondly we find that in some cultures nature is assumed as awesome and fearsome therefore in many african tribes or even in some asian countries european countries uh, they assume that if there is a thunderstorm if there is some uh, electrification uh, clouds are clashing then they assume that this is nature and therefore we bow down to nature islamic world is different it tells us that this is a, a show of the strength of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala therefore you uh, praise and glorify his name not clouds or not electrification and thirdly there are certain social constructs this term is used in sociology and anthropology with reference to even in law with reference to all those uh, conventions that take place among people with the passage of time in uh, japan if you are uh, visiting uh, a friend or a stranger you don't shake hand you bow down uh, there are also bow downs and quite often it is done again and again to show more respect this is social custom social norm it is a social construct they assume that in this way they are paying more respect as compared to a smile and shaking hand therefore non tawhidic world view have their own basic concepts 